Welcome to Skinny TV on YouTube once again. Let's see the latest news coming in from the camp of Ghana Black Stars team. Coach Chris Hitting, he has officially brought out the 24-man squad going to play against Madagascar. Don't forget, 18th of June, 2 p.m. at Antananarivo, we are going to have the Barrier of Madagascar versus the Black Stars of Ghana. And after the 24-man squad was released, many are talking about some players that um, you know we were expecting them to be in the squad. Obviously, not every player can make it into the Black Stars of Ghana's team, but there are some players that whenever they are not there, um, you know, you have you got to ask one or two questions. So we are going to check out about 18 of them in this video. 18 is a huge number, but I'll make it very snappy for you on this channel as well, but detailed, of course, for you. So before we jump into it, some players you know them already. Patrick Pfeiffer, many of us were expecting him to be there. Jeffrey Schlock, we were expecting him to be there. Then some other key players I have in here. We will talk about that as well before then please drop us a like like the video after liking if you are new make sure you subscribe if you are new subscribe then put on the post notification bell on all for more updates on this channel i also try and give some few shout outs or i'll give shout out to those who have commented so far under the last video the video i uploaded before this one so let's jump into it the first player we'll talk about here is going to be no players done Patrick Pfeiffer, I've already talked about this player on a number of occasions on this channel, how good he is, the qualities he possesses, he plays for Darmstadt 98 in the German Bundesliga 2 this season, he has helped the club side to qualify to the German Bundesliga itself, he is highly rated, his contract is coming to an end and he, according to multiple sources we have already, he has signed a pre-contract with FC Osberg to play next season in the German Bundesliga, so yes, he has done really well for the club side, and I personally do not understand why this player is not getting called up to join the Black Stars of Ghana's team. To be honest with you, because if Salih Mohamed is not in the team, I was expecting Patrick Pfeiffer to be in this team. Even though Coach Chris Hitting might have his reasons, you know, as I said already, not all of us will be satisfied with the squad. But for Patrick Pfeiffer, I don't know why. Because last year, um, we were told by the Ghana Football Association that five players switched in the to join Ghana. Himself, that's Patrick Pfeiffer, Tarek Lamte, Inyaki Williams, Rans for the Bok on Isdofa, um, Stefan Ambrosius. Four of them have gotten callers before, but only Patrick Pfeiffer. I don't know the reason why, and that is the question for um, Coach Chris. Hitting. In case we get a chance, that will be the question I personally will ask him. Maybe in a pre-match, or maybe um, you know, naming of the squad, he's done it already. So I don't think we can have opportunity to ask him this question. But I would personally like him to answer why. Patrick Pfeiffer is always out of Black Stars of Ghana's team. Francis Amuzu is also a player that I've already told you that he has switched nationality from Belgium to Ghana. He has played very well this season for Anderlecht. He continues to play well, but I don't know why. Um, for the four new players we are looking at, he is also not part of this club because I think we are going to lose some ringers. I mean, maybe to the Nigerian three side. I was expecting him to be in here, but that is that. Grigion Che is also a striker who played for Clermont Fort in France. I was expecting him to be here, but I said it that I don't know the extent of the nationality switch with Grigion Che. That is why I would actually be quiet on him. So Grigion Che, not really surprised to me. Jordan Emisa is a goalkeeper for Berton Albion. I am expecting him to be in the Ghana and at in fresh squad. So he's not here and I just wanted to speak about him because um, he's not getting playing minutes just like our other two goalkeepers. That Joseph Wallacott and Manaf Nuruddin. I would go for um, Razak Abelua to come in and also give them some competition in there. But that is that. Now, next player is Ransford Yeboah Konig Stofer. Ransford Yeboah Konig Stofer. For him, he is an already old face. The first four I looked at is the new faces to be seen. Ransford Yeboah Konig Stofer actually missed it out. So, you know, I don't know whether maybe he will be added to the Ghana and Twain squad that will go to uh, Morocco to play in the AFCON ahead of qualifying for the Olympic Games in 2024. So, Ransford Yeboah I didn't see him and we all didn't see him. Kamal Sowa is one name that he got a lot of call-ups since he, he, he chose to play for Ghana. But he never had a um, you know, lot of minutes to play for Ghana. Not even... Uh, he never had minutes to play for the Black Stars of Ghana. So we don't know. I think he came on to do some few minutes in the Switzerland friendly game before the World Cup. After that, Kamal Sowa, he has been in the national team. He was not getting opportunities. And now he is out of the squad. Kasim Adams. 
most of you will agree with me that I mean, if you look at FC Basel in Switzerland, one of the top defenders they have this season, Kasim Adams. And I was personally looking out for him in case maybe we do not get some one or two players in defense, Salisu and others, maybe he will come in. But, you know, the coach did not select Kasim Adams. And I think it was a shocking news to me. Richard Ofori, for him, I think we all understand he's now returning from injury. So um, I'm not expecting him to be there, of course. Idris Subaba is one player that many are now arguing. Idris Subaba or Edmond Ado. <laughs> it's a debate, you know. Uh, well, Edmond Ado was invited ahead of Idris Subaba. Maybe per the coach, um, you know, kind of philosophy or what he sees in the player. He sees him to be very good the last call up i told you he was the only player that i had doubts about him he came he didn't really impress most of us i don't know if he impressed in the two games against angola but he has end call up again but idris baba did not end call up. he plays for al city maloka in spain christopher and J. ah personally i was looking for him to come but a player like you know um Kwesi Ocherit, i'll come and speak about him this season all season he has scored three goals provided one assist four goal contribution but Christopher and Chieje, I think um, I was looking for it for him to be added to the team. He plays very well for VFL Bokum, and I have brought you updates on him already. Abdomumin Suleiman. Abdomumin plays for Rava Akalo in Spain. He is a top defender. Um, um, I think I was also shocked, you know, having Nicola Sopuku in the squad ahead of Abdomumin, then Kasim Adams. Personally, I was shocked on that front. So, yes, he also did not get opportunity. Jeffrey Schlopp, what is going on? Jeffrey Schlopp is a player that most of us were looking forward for him to officially or now to return to the Black Stars of Ghana's team. But yet another call-up, no Jeffrey Schlopp, you know. And I don't know what is going on with the player. He plays very well for Crystal Palace, but missing out in international duties. We all know what happened before the World Cup, but the player himself did not comment about anything. But he is still out of this squad. Razak Abalowa, as I said already, I would have loved him to join this squad, but he is not in here. And I added him to the 18 players. Joao Familia is one striker who plays for Robin Kazan. This season he has been fantastic. He has been impressive, helping them to win the league in there and also qualify for the Premier League in um that is ukraine but he is not in here so yes we are not seeing joe of Amir. and personally i think he could have replaced in the um that is Antoine salam semenyo who has missed out due to injury brandon thomas asante as i said already i don't know the extent of communication between coach chris Hitton and the striker who plays for west bromwich Albion. therefore i it wouldn't be a surprise to me if he doesn't end call up Fatal Isahaku is also a player who plays for Sporting CP. I think for him, purposely, he is going to be added to the Ghana and 23 squad. And that's why maybe he is out of this team. Daniel Friebania, I think he's also going to join the Ghana and 23 side. And um, since joining FC Zurich, he has not really been performing well for them in the few minutes he has been getting. Felix Alpina Fenerja, his club side has been relegated. That's US Cremonese in the Eternal Serie A. They are now going to play in the Eternal Serie B. And I'm expecting him to go to the Antoine Threat side. And I was, I was not expecting him, you know, to get called up to join the Black Stars of Ghana's team. With Ernest Noama appear, I think he's doing well with FC Nordland and getting called up. I was rather thinking that maybe later on he will be allowed to join our two and three side because we need him looking at the exploit that he made against Algeria to help us qualify. We need him in the AFCON itself. So, guys, these are the 18 players Patrick Paifa, Francis Samo, Zubri Janche, Jordan, Emisa, Ratfa, Ebwa, Konezdofa, Kamal, Sowa, Kasim Adams, Richard Ofori, Idris Subaba, Christopher Entry, Ejab, Dumumi, Suleiman, Jeffrey Schlob, Razaka, Balora, Joa Famaye, Brandon Thomas, Asante, Fatah, Isahaku, Daniel Free, Banier, and Felix Ahinafenejan. I was expecting at least some of them to make their squad and they the players for you let me know your thoughts under the comments box those who commented under the last video let me quickly run you through and give them shout out of course kinsley ashon you commented under the last video thank you for being here um daniel mate said he was first here thank you daniel i appreciate your presence um then i have kevin sala kevin sala thank you for being here francis bright you are also here thank you i appreciate you philip kweku you are also here i've seen you and with senior jacob yuri thank you for being here i've seen you augustine chumesi you are also here thank you quantum cranky quantum cranky thank you for being here i've seen you Inno abdo Inno abdo i've seen you are doing well obese samuel is also here yao quest okay yao quest is here 
Peter um, Mefe too. Peter Mefe too, you are here. Thank you. Philip Kweku, I have seen you. You said I should mention you. Philip Kweku, I have given you a shout out. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you a lot. And Ferry Foster is also here. Um, Hayford Kuala, Hayford, I have seen you. Begbe Solomon in Trosip, you are always here. So your name is already here. Begbe Solomon in Trosip, thank you for being here. Um, Abdul Mumin, you are also here. Thank you. Are you the Blasters player that I just spoke about? Well, Abu KKY Kwesi, okay. Abu KKY Kwesi, thank you. Uchicha Clan, you are also here. Thank you, Uchicha. Acro GH, Acro GH, thank you. I've seen you. Um, Prince Akuri, Prince Akuri, thank you. Charles Dapa, I have seen you, of course. Emmanuel Sebosu is also here. Thomas has also commented. Um, then I have um, Dambi Chris, you are also here. Bekun Richard, Bekun, I appreciate you, bro. Thank you for being here. God Peace is also here. God Peace, thank you. Mr. Rich, you are also here. I appreciate you a lot. Don Emmanuel is or do Emmanuel, sorry, do Emmanuel. I've seen your comments. Um, Benjamin Arnold Aka is here, and I'll continue the rest in the next video. Let me know your thoughts in the comment box. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe, put on the bell for more updates on this channel. This was Kenny TV, and of course, we shall meet later.